I got into racing when I was six. Um, my dad did a, a go-kart demonstration when I was four years old on the, on the dealership parking lot and I saw that and I really wanted to try it and couldn't reach the pedals so I cried the whole day uh, and annoyed my dad to get me a go-kart when I grew. Finally when I was six years old uh, that's uh, when I got my first go-kart and but I remember it was blue and um, when I look at the pictures now like my helmet was way too big and my suit was way too big and um, that's how it kind of all started and after that did 10 years of go-karting and then went to America, uh, raced over there, ended up in IndyCars which is quite special. Uh, got the chance to test F1 as well so that was really a childhood dream coming true and now I am here in Supercars in Australia. Challenge in supercar is just uh, the level of the field. You know, every driver is so competitive, and for example, in qualifying, everybody is almost within a second, which is is really remarkable. Not many series have that, and the cars are quite uh, difficult to drive as well. You know, they have uh, a lot of horsepower, not a lot of aerodynamics, so the car moves around quite a lot, and and that makes it quite challenging. And you have to really understand how to drive this car, your applications and stuff like that are quite different than, than any other car that I've ever driven. Racing is maybe not the first sport a girl gets into, but uh, I was really passionate about driving a race car and, and really loved it. And really focus on that and also made the people around me know that that's what I wanted to do and that's how it kind of all came about because I, I really worked hard behind it and I think that's like in, in any job I would say you know if, if anybody is passionate about it not to be shy about it uh, you know yeah focus behind it and go for it. <laughs>